Hi everybody, I am Delta Prime and you are watching Delta Prime Reviews where today we will be taking a look at Transformers War for Cybertron Trilogy, Kingdom Dinobot and he is a Voyager class. Now Dinobot comes with two accessories that make up his tail and you're probably saying but Delta Prime this is one f accessory, you're wrong. Inside the tail is a sword you can hold in either hand and this spinny shield thing which Doesn't actually spin but it's like it's supposed to yeah So yeah And you can store robot mode it stores right here That's where the tail will be So yeah um, Articulation Heads on a ball joint. Can rotate 360 degrees. Can look up that much. Can look down that much. Shoulder on a swivel. Swivel here. Swivel there. Um, swivel, I guess. It's not really a swivel. Hinge right there. Hinge here. Hinge here. Swivel there. Hinge hands. There is waist articulation. Can kick out that much, can kick forward that much, can kick back barely any, can go forward <laughs> that much, go back that much. There is a tight, tight swivel. And there is ankle pivot. So yeah, let's get strange to transformation. Oh, it's been a while. Let's see if I remember how to transform this guy. First off, I believe you like you have to bend these and turn these around like this. This will allow you to. Oh, first, first you have to take the claws out. These become the raptor hands. Let the tail fall off. Then you can pull these up. And then you turn this like that. Do that over here. Turn it. That will allow you to unpeg this. And then you're going just going to unpeg back here. Pull this up like so. And then you're just going to fold it over the head like that. Now, fold up the raptor head. Get those out of the way. Rotate the waist 180 degrees so that it looks like this. Open these up, fold these in, Take the same over here, and then these will peg in to multiple places. And then this is supposed to go past that. Same over here. Put that like that. Bring these down. Rotate the hands or what will become the feet. Whoops. Accidentally pop it off the ball joint.
plug tail in. And there, you have Dinobot in his raptor mode. Now, this is a very realistic raptor. I like it a lot, except for, well, that. That gap at the front, the obvious robot cable in the back, and yeah. But they, it's what they had to work with. It's what they had to work with, unfortunately. But I like it. It's uh, it's actually pretty neat, you know. Yeah, you know. It it get it gets the job done. So I've been Delta Prime, asking you to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video review. Bye!